वेलकम एवरीबॉडी वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल एंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर अ न्यू टूल विच इज दू एम आई टूल एक्चुअली हु एम आई इज ऑलरेडी अ कमांड इन कैलिनिक्स विच टेल्स यू अबाउट द स्टेटस ऑफ यूर अकाउंट वेदर यू आर अ रूट यूजर और यू आर अर यू आर अ नॉर्मल यूजर ऑन द सिस्टम बट दिस टूल इज पर्टिकुलरली फॉर एनोनिमिटी एंड टू मेक यू एनोनिमस ऑन द on the internet or to clear your website logs and all those things so what's the need for this tool the main question arises here so the need is quite clear i guess because all of us uh, tend to you know we make some digital fingerprints that can be used to track us for example you visit a certain website okay the uh, you visited a website and the website has reg registered a log with your ip address that okay this ip visited this website at this time and from this geo location okay since your ip is tagged with your geo location so it can be used to trace you okay that's a very easy way to trace you so rather than you are using kali linux kali linux can also you can also create some digital print fingerprints uh, without uh, in your knowledge that can basically lead or that can basically betray you okay so as a ha as hackers we don't want that right so we will explore a new tool here that is who am i tool which will be available on the github so let me just open my kali machine and i will meet you when this will be open till then just wait for a minute so yeah i have uh, opened my kali linux machine and we will go to the firefox uh, actually the tool we will be using is the who am i tool i have told you earlier this is for anonymity purposes so who am i i will search who am i on firefox okay so i need to mention who am i github so it will okay so this is a tool this is the tool that is by this developer over dogen okay so let's click on here i will copy the link and we will perform our usual command git clone command okay let me zoom in it's cloning into this directory that is the who am i project it will take some time let's wait for it to finish then i will show you how to install it in your system okay so we are done with the cloning part and let me first move okay so we are done with the cloning part so first let me move into my root directory as it may require root privileges okay now i am root so i will cd into this who am i project directory clear this ls and as i can see that there are some files and a directory here that is the assets here's this kali humai which is the actual tool this is the license file this is this is the make file which will be installing here that is sudo make install and this is the readme file we can also view it here let me scroll down a bit okay it also explains uh what it does so let me zoom in yeah so uh the this tool has certain modules its first module is nt mitm mitm stands for man in middle attacks so it's here it automatically bans attackers during man in the middle attacks i will be bringing a video on this too so wait for it this is the log killer it securely deletes system log files using the overwrite method so basically wh whenever you log into this your kali machine it creates a log okay so it clears this log which is important because logs can also you know if somebody uh, get your logs it can be also against you okay so you need to clear your logs too for perf or for to achieve ultimate anonymity and as you all know ip changer which is a 
very important tool. It redirects all network traffic through a Tor transparent proxy, DNS changer, MAC changer, anti-cold boot which prevents RAM dumps by securely deleting sensitive traces, time zone changer, hostname changer, okay, browser anonymization and I, does, I do not know what this feature does so we will explore it by using the tool. Hostname changer is something that uh, what's the host name okay. uh, you the host host name is basically your machine's name so if you have named your machine that uh, which can be used to retrieve some information about you that's very you know that's not a good idea so it changes your host name for my I have named my host as host so that's you know that's quite a good name right so okay so yeah we forgot how to install it so let's do that so the first command you should run is this so let me copy this command and go here paste it in here and hit enter it will take some time I have already updated my system so that should not take time but this thing the these things these in, these things installation may take some time so let's wait for it to install So yeah, we have finished with the installation and there are some steps that you will encounter. So it prompted me to with a yes or no option. So you will, okay, you should put a yes in here by typing Y. So you need to install so that you can install all these modules and tools that's necessary for this tool. So I will, I will clear it from, I will clear the terminal. I will ls now okay so we have completed this step okay we have cloned the repository already so now we are left with this step only so let's do this step hit enter and yeah we are done we are done with the installation okay so how to access this tool let me see so you can access this tool by typing sudo kali who am I and then dash dash help so let's copy this and paste this paste it. okay so in order to start this tool we must we must specify the tool kali who am I okay as you can see it's highlighted in blue with dash dash start let's start okay so it prompts us with the nine modules that we have seen in the github page of this tool so what do you think let's first go with the IP changer okay so let's do three and hit enter okay so it doesn't tell us about anything that what's uh, what's the new IP that has uh, that has been changed so we will have to check it ourselves so let us let us check what is our new IP. Let us see here what is my IP address. Okay, I guess it has changed our IP because you know I close the tab. Wait a minute. Yeah. So as you can see here, it IP in IP changer, it redirects all network traffic through a Tor transparent proxy. So that's why we are getting this to verify ourselves. So I guess the IP changer has worked for us. As you can see, it has worked. Uh, okay, so it displays my city Luxembourg, which is not correct at all. Okay, so yeah, our IP is changed and we we have successfully changed our IP and that's very good this means this option has worked so let's check another option which is I guess the host name changer let me check hit enter maybe my host name has changed I don't know I, I don't know anything to check if my host name has changed or not I hope that this option has worked too. Let me check again. Uh, 
I don't know how to check if my host name is changed or not. Okay, so let us go with this time zone changer. Okay, time zone change successfully. Let's see if our time zone is changed. I hope I can check my time zone with this. Yes, it's changed. It's uh, it's saying that uh, my time zone is Iran standard time, which is not correct. Okay, so this tool has worked in quite some cases. Well, I don't know how to check it for the other options. Okay, I don't know how to check it for uh, this hostname changer, whether it has changed my hostname or not. And this browser anonymization is, I don't know what this means. So, log killer, it will kill the logs. DNS changer, it will change my DNS server to some, you know, safe server. And TMITM, I will bring, I will make a video on this MITM attack and we will then use this tool to check if this works okay so for this uh, video I am ending it here okay so this is it for uh, for this video I hope you like this video and I'm seeing that you all are you know liking my other videos too so since I'm a new creator well I'm uh, getting a, a quite good response but you know uh, I've, I've getting some quite good views and please uh, everyone who are viewing my videos uh, who are viewing this video too please check out my other videos and please comment okay at least comment how you did you like this video or what I can improve so it will help me a lot okay because I'm also in the learning phase you guys are learning too so let us help ourselves right you tell me what I can improve okay and I will you know give you more content with the improved version so that will help both of us right so for this uh video uh i guess this is enough you can check out this tool okay so till then take care goodbye and thank you for watching my videos okay i will meet you in the next one